Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my freebies and I only got like four things today so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing the Colors of the Rainbow tag which is a really fun tag. Um, I was not tagged by anyone but I don't care so I'm going to do it. But not even being tagged and I'm sorry if you hear my fan. It is super duper hot today and yeah. So, that being said, um, the girl that came up with this tag was Talk Becky Talk, and I'm not going to be listing her channel down below because I don't know who she is. So, <laughs> but yeah, um, the first thing is I'm going to be doing Roy G. Biv, which is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet which is what my school taught me so yeah so the first thing that I have for you is the Maybelline color whisper and who wore it redder which is on my lips yes really really dark red um, so this is who wore it redder and it's a really dark red um, it's not really dark it's not really really dark but it is a really really nice red um really very pigmented and this is like the most popular one out of the whole collection i believe um this is the only one i have actually too i'm going to be getting more of those so they are really good really creamy um most uh, um they're very smooth um probably almost like a lip balm i would say because you know it's really like, I don't know, it just glides like when you smudge it like in your lips. It's like really smooth and it glides on your lips. So I definitely recommend that. It's an A plus from me. So orange, I have my Tangerine EOS. Um, a while back in a few of my older videos, if you have been with me for a long time, you saw, you would have saw that my... Um, products I regret buying video I hated this one but I actually kind of like it because it's a medicated lip balm which is hence the reason why it's a medicated lip balm and why it smells like it's a medicated lip balm um, but the flavor is really magnificent um, the smell eh, could be better they could hide the medicated part um, but yeah, it's really good and good overall medicated lip balm in the end. The yellow, I have my Vaseline Total Moisture, and this is the Pure Oat Extract. Um, I got this a while ago, like probably two, maybe one year ago, and I'm still working it off. Um. And I used to apply it, I, I apply it all the time when I shave my legs because, <clears throat> because your legs get very dried out from the razor, I, th I guess. I'm not really sure that's what I heard, but your legs get really dried out from the razor. And so I just want to keep my moisture in there and it's really good. And it smells, um, it does not smell like Vaseline, I can tell you that, which is a good thing because Vaseline doesn't even really have a smell, but it does smell good. It's kind of, I, I, for me and my preferences, I'd say it smells like baby wipes, scented baby wipes, like the Huggies, but I don't know. Green, girl, I have the simple cleansing wipes. These I use to take off my makeup. Um, these are rather on the pricey side. They're like $6.99 and $5.99 at my uh, grocery store. But uh, they are really good. They do cleanse your face like they say. Um, I bought mine at CVS. If you were wondering, you guys saw it in a haul of mine a while ago. Uh, that's really all I have to say about them. They do cleanse your face. They I'm not going to say they make it soft because soft because I haven't really been noticing, but I think they actually do help with pimples because when I use these, like, as you can tell, 
my pimplers are going down except to have one right here not right here and it sucks but plus I think that's the EFA clear too so next for blue this is no surprise I have the Maybelline rocket mascara um, I'm actually not wait am I wearing this? yeah I actually am wearing this now and it does make your lashes really uh, volumey really long yeah yeah I think that yeah volume I, I don't know but who gives a heck but um I like it it's the packaging is like a good packaging um the Maybelline packaging are always really unique just like with the cat eyes and everything like that I like how they do the little bump right there and it's like a little blue thing and it tricks you. It makes it think it's to the part that comes off, but really, it's not. At Indigo, I have my LA Colors Jumbo Eye Pencil in Bikini Time. And it looks like this. And I will swatch it. So that is Bikini Time. And I use the... I'm going to be, hopefully, making a... um. Uh, tutorial, an alien tutorial, a girl, a girl Martian tutorial with this in October. So hopefully I can get that up. But it's really pretty, 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 and it's only a dollar fifty. So the next thing, um, I got this off of, um, I got this off of Listia. Um, it's the Urban Decay 24-7 and this is in Delinquent and I love this stuff um, who doesn't love Urban Decay and that's what it looks like it does have a shimmer to it um, I use it for like my lower lash line because it like I don't know it's it's an eyeliner stick light on shadow pencil but I mean I use it for like, you know, I might use it for an eyeshadow, but it's just like too, um, bright for me, so that's why I don't use it as an eyeshadow, because I like the neutral type of eyeshadows. Now, finally, I am getting into my freebies, and the first thing I got was from, um, Chicken of the Sea. Uh, my birthday is this month on the 26th. Um, I'm so excited because I'm turning 18, which I'm kind of not excited, but then I am because you get presents on your birthday. But it's not all about hell, this ain't Christmas. It is all about presents on your damn birthday, girl. So, yeah, um, it's from Chicken of the Sea, and it's a 50 cent off coupon. Which will be good because I think they're like a dollar a can up at my grocery store and my grocery store doubles so it will be free. Next is from Walmart.com and it's the Advil and I got a um, little Advil, two Advil capsules tablet and these are good for traveling and everything and then it comes with a one dollar off coupon like I was saying they're good for traveling because you know you never know if you'll get a headache and you don't wanna if you're at a plate if you're at an expensive place you don't wanna buy a ten ninety nine bottle of Advil so this comes in handy and then lastly magazines guys this week has been total crap okay I got Red Bulletin which I don't even really read, but I look through it sometimes. Um, I don't know. Do you guys read through this? Comment down below and tell me if you guys ever read through your red bulletin. Because I just like look through it, like look at the pictures and everything, and then I'm done. So. And then I got Glamour, which Glamour sucks ass because they never include any samples. Well, only... Okay, let's see. They include perfume sample but that's about it what am I going to do with a damn little swatchy sample of a perfume nothing but you know it's free so hey but still they could include some makeup coupons or something like that 
But no, they're too damn cheap. They're all about freaking story or whatever. But anywho, I'm happy with what I got. I guess. Hopefully tomorrow we'll be we'll bring more treasures. And if you guys have any questions, comments, please leave them down below. And I will see you guys tomorrow because I'm going thrifting. So bye guys. Love ya.